Hey folks, William here, LRB Adventures. If you can't tell, we are at the Magic Kingdom, of course. <laughs> right at the entrance, of course. We want to just take in the Christmas decorations. We were here the other night and uh, it was raining a little bit, so we didn't do much filming. So uh, uh, we've got a uh, Mickey's Very Merry Christmas party in just two days. And so we want to come in and just get some views of these, okay? Um, come along with us. Hopefully you enjoy it. Don't know exactly what we're going to do. We've got some friends we're going to be meeting here. Melinda's here. Uh, Alicia is supposed to be here. And who knows who else will show up. It's 50-50 shot. we got a feeling there may be some characters, though. But let's see. made it to the train station of course and look right behind us wow you know really when I come in right after the change is taking place from Halloween to Christmas it's it's a little shocker right off the bat but it's so exciting it kind of gets you in the mood for Christmas right off the bat and the neat thing about it is when you have guests coming in uh, like we used to uh, before we moved down here, we were in the Christmas mood gearing up coming in, whether it was the first week of November or whatever it may be, or the last week of December. It was still done in the same tasteful way that uh, it just drew you in. And uh, it kind of gives you that feeling like an old time Christmas all the time. So we're going to check a lot of the uh, decorations out and take in some of the things today just to give you a glimpse of exactly what's going on and um, hopefully uh, it gets you excited about Christmas. <laughs> We're heading down Main Street, USA. Looks like the Dapper Dans are performing down here, so I uh, don't know exactly how much further they are from me, but the sound is very close. There they are. They're in their candy cane outfits. Stop the traffic. 
Hey, so look who finally showed up. Alicia, hello. say hello. There we go. So <laughs> we are at, of course, we're at the Magic Kingdom. We are actually going to be doing just a review on a lot of new products, merchandise that they have, or as she likes to say, merch that they have here at the, where are we at? Emporium. The Emporium, right off Main Street. So we're going to basically just get some of these items for Christmas. There you are. That's my fault. I moved you right out of the way. See, he and complained that I was, hadn't seen me in a long time, but yet he's cutting me out of the video. That's right. She's not been in a video in about 35 days. Wow. That's, people wow. have been writing, wondering where she disappeared to. Okay. But we did get her out on work release, so it's awesome. Uh, <laughs> no, I just, um, I was in training for a new position. That's what there we go. So uh, she's moving up in the world and moving on out. But she is going to spend a little time with us today. We are going to go over some of these uh, different items and uh, hopefully you'll enjoy it. We're going to also get a little bit of the uh, lights and everything, the decoration once it gets a little dark, okay? Mm -hmm. We've already got a lot now, but uh, we'll see uh, what it looks like once it gets dark. That is too cool. How much is that? This is $79.99. $79.99. There we have it. A stitch. <laughs> I'm not even a big that stitch awesome. fan, but I really think this is adorable. Oh, that is cool. That is just a great Christmas sweater. And it's more like a sweatshirt, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's very, very thin, too. In a, in a, in a comfortable way. It would still be warm, I think but it's this thin. Be It'd be perfect for like this is a good thin thinness warmness for Florida when it gets a little chilly. Right. Because you know there's. to get a little bit darker here tonight and um, when I say a little bit darker we've got a heavy overcast with some showers in the area so it's getting a little bit darker a little bit quicker but all of the lights have come on uh, 
for all the decorations and we're starting to see some of these pop. We are heading over to grab a bite to eat at um, Pecos Bills and then we're going to come back out here to enjoy some of the lights and things of that sort just to take that in. Now with the, a lot of the information we did put in for the um, new merchandise that was in the Emporium, if um, you see anything here that you'd like to get some um, pricing information on, just let us know and we'll uh, send that back to you in a message. So uh, uh, please, again, like, share, subscribe and uh, on to the next thing, right? Um, we are this way. Actually, we're going to be... <laughs> somebody just has to be in the shot. Wow, Melinda was right. Uh, and yet he was complaining that I haven't been around. Okay. So, I mean, you know, they say women are complicated. Point taken, are they ever. But, regardless, okay, we are heading around to Pecos Bills. They do have a new menu, which we've actually tried a couple times, and uh, their bowls are excellent. They really are. And we'll see from a true Mexican perspective. There you go. I'm, I am not a major connoisseur when it comes to Mexican food. Uh, Tex-Mex a little bit, we're but that. point taken. But we're trying, okay? It, Look at those shoes. Oh dear, look at there. Big Al? Big Al! Look at you. Oh my god. I know. When I grow up. Jingle, 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 cruise. Jingle, jingle, jingle. <laughs> Just gotten off of Big Thunder Mountain Row Row. We are now heading to the Haunted Mansion. The Haunted Mansion has a wait time of 13 minutes. And if you don't know what 13 minutes means on the Haunted Mansion, tell them. It's a walk-on. It is a walk-on. Here's some trivia for you. What is another ride if you see the number 13 minute wait is also a walk-on? Put it in the comments hmm. below. I hope you don't fall down thinking about it right right right, right. okay right. right so we are heading on down and hopefully it stays a 13. creepy as it may be lucky that 13. is the plus there ain't nothing lucky about 13 but it does hey, that work was my water polo number she water polo yeah. do the horses make it <laughs> Wouldn't that endanger the lives of the horses? Water polo. They dip down, walk, come up for air, dip down, come up for air. <laughs> We're rotten on it, Mitchell.